Hey everybody, this is Josh with Down to the Roots, and this is going to be just a real quick update on my seed starting comparison I've been doing. We're on day 17, so about two and a half weeks since I've started all these. As you can see, I've already thinned them out like I said I was going to do, and I've already topped them off with soil. I probably won't be able to do the cucumbers because they're not tall enough yet, and they'll be needing to come out of this soil soon anyway because you can see the roots coming in. But so far, what I've noticed is the kale, there's no difference in the two different mixes so far. They have grown the same, pretty well the same color. They are all looking real good. They are all on the same set of true leaves pretty well that they have started so far. So the kale, I don't see no difference. The cucumbers, the colors are a little bit different. I don't know if you can tell with this camera, but the ones that are in the ocean forest mix is a little bit darker green than the plants that are in the vermicompost mix. But as far as growth wise, they are on their same set of true leaves. They're starting their second set and the leaves are roughly the same size. They actually seem healthier than the ocean forest ones because these do have a little yellow rim around them that means they might have some kind of deficiency but we'll know once they get a little bit bigger. As far as the tomatoes go there's not really much of a difference in them. This one is a little bit smaller in the vermicompost mix than all the rest of them but that could be the plant itself. I did have a little trouble with tomatoes trying to sprout out of my vermicompost mix because I feed tomatoes to my worms so in the future I'm probably going to not feed tomatoes to one of my bins that way I can make a good mix out of them but as far as the color goes the color on both the two different mixes are the same the growth rate is looking to be the same they're on their same set of true leaves they're getting ready to start their second even though this one's smaller it's still starting its second set of true leaves so I'm thinking that could be a uh, volunteer tomato that started and I plucked out their own ones but we'll figure that out eventually but as far as the mixes go two and a half weeks in they're looking the same so so far so good I might be able to cut out my cost a little bit buying the potting mix and just use my seed starting mix or use my vermicompost mix for my seed starting but I'm going to take some close-up pictures of the different sets that way you can see the roots I mean I don't know if you can see real good but the roots on the tomatoes are coming in I mean the tomatoes on the ocean forest mix and tomatoes in the vermicompost mix the roots are pretty close to the same so there's not a big difference in them so far and same way with the cucumbers I mean the roots look pretty well the same in both of them there might be a few more roots in the ocean forest but you get up see they're pretty close to the same but so far so good like I said, I'm going to keep you updated on them about every week, like I have been. Like I said, we're about two and a half weeks in now. It's been a week since my first video that I made on it. But I'm going to take some pictures here, and I'll put them at the end of the video, and just keep you updated. But thanks for watching, and subscribe to my channel to stay updated on it. And if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, leave them in the comment box below. Thanks for watching.